Hey, real quick before watching this video, I recommend watching the video in the top right of your screen. It is the video that kickstarted this video, and also it's just a really fun video to watch. Hey guys, Pip here. Welcome to Crazy Signs with Tall Pip. So, as I just told you, I'm, um, yesterday, uh, Cosmic Vlogs came over and we put thumbtacks in Nerf darts. And we m put a little gun, and we put them in a gun, we shot them at styrofoam and stuff, and it was super duper fun. But, uh, I asked a question during that video, and it was, ooh, could I fit these into a mag? And that's what I'm going to try to do today. I have two thumbtacks, because all the other ones are in the nerf darts. So, I'm going to be trying to fill up a six-round mag, stick mag, with nerf darts. And it, if you want to know how to make these uh, thumbtack nerf darts, it's really easy. You don't need to glue anything. Oh, there we go. So, you just pop off the little top piece. And these are some different Nerf darts than like the regular like brand ones. Then you just get a thumbtack and you can just literally shove it in. But um, if you shove the thumbtack in, as you can see, it, it, it's a bit longer than the regular bullets, which means I don't. Can it fit into a mag? I, if if this just fits into the mag, well, I need to I need to push it in a bit more. So when you have it all the way pushed in, I can. L it does, it almost fits in the mag. <gasps> it works! Yes! I can put it in a mag. Now, the real question. Can I fire it out of the mag? I'm just going to be using this because I don't want it to get caught in the barrel. So I'm just going to take the barrel off. And now I'm just going to pop the mag inside I really should not be looking at it this time cock it you can see it's in there and load it forward it's gonna take a quick peek it's in there oh my goodness I need to get a piece of styrofoam be right back I'm back and I have a piece of styrofoam I don't know what this camera's FOV is so I'm just gonna put the styrofoam right here and then shoot it and I'm gonna shoot it from this side. Or actually, no, I shouldn't. Because then it, you wouldn't be able to see the dart. Alright, three! Why is there a rubber. Wait, what the frick? There's a rubber band on the tack rail. Alright, ready? Three, two, one. It shot! The fact that it shot is beautiful. Where'd it go? It's down there. But yeah, I can. So it does shoot. For some reason, it didn't go into the styrofoam. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh my god! It works! Yes. Okay, I'm gonna fill a mag. There we go. We have a. We have four rounds in a stick mag. This is the dumbest idea for a video. Yet I feel like it, it works. Okay, so, I want to move this back a bit. Here we go. I'm just going to be sitting down here and just shooting it. Three. Shot one. Three. Two. One. <laughs> okay, does, does the reloading process work? Pop it down. Pull it back up. Three. Two. One. Okay, that one didn't hit. Okay, three out of the four hit, but they didn't really stick in. But still, Jesus. See, now, for the real test. Uh, I, I want to try to shoot it, shoot them out of the, out of my other, like, big nerf gun, which is the Scravager. But anyways, um, we're, gonna, we're doing barrel test, because, um... The darts aren't as aerodynamic, I don't think, as the um, actual Nerf darts. So I want to see if a barrel helps with that. And I'm going to move this chair back a bit more. Because this thing actually has a kick. Locked and loaded. Going back here. Three, two, one. Okay. So I'm actually pretty sure that the barrel 
makes them actually fly straighter. Because without the barrel, yeah, they land a bit curved. Now, for the next test, I want to see if I can just full auto. Now, uh, slam fire on. And I'm just going to try to just full auto, just empty this in like five seconds. Three, two, one. <laughs> oh! She! <laughs> this is the stupidest video idea I've ever had. But, um, pretty sure that's gonna do it for this video. If you did enjoy, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more content just like this. This has been Pip, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye! Also, watch Cosmic's channel.